Hello, uh, today I'm going to show you uh, my fish, my pet fish, okay? So, um, here are my pet fish, uh, they call it uh, snakehead or chana. Uh, this is yellow centaurum. Um, I kept it uh, since it's uh, 6 inch uh, until now, it's about 2 years plus, so it's about um, one and a half feet now. Uh, colors, uh, the bars, and all there. Uh, mental is also uh, quite good. Uh, but uh, the only thing lacking is the white spot, or they call it the flowers of uh, the fish, is not so prominent. Anyway, this is uh, my pets, my pet fish. Okay, so I have also have another pet fish at uh, uh, the, the, the bottom here, um, which are the Chana Red Barito. Uh, the red haven't come out yet uh, just a little bit so as you can see the mantle is uh, very aggressive more aggressive than the yellow center room uh, on top okay so today um, uh, I just bought some um, baby frog as you can see uh, baby frog five of them um, uh, 80 cents uh, ringgit Malaysia each from the fish shop uh, Occasionally, I will feed them frogs, uh, but not all the time. Uh, also, I have kept some of the worms here, some of the uh, mealworms, um, bigger and the smaller size one. These are the mealworms. Okay. Also, have the small one. Okay. I I I put it here as in sort of like breeding them also, so that I don't need to buy always. Uh, they actually have also the small kind of uh, worms and also the big one. These are the the mama and papa of the of the worms, uh, you know. So I just put it here so that they can lay eggs and uh, you know, like they are evolving uh, on their own and growing up. And I feed them uh, with um, I feed them with. Um, uh, like fruits, uh, uh, fish foods, and all and all kind of uh, uh, leftovers. Uh, they, they they will eat any, uh, practically always anything. Uh, I also have here some um, baby baby koi fish, um, which I keep here to allow them to grow, uh, so that uh, when they are bigger a bit. Uh, uh, they are also used as a as a feed for for my chana, my pet two pet fish. Before this, I have few, but some of them uh, died and some of them are sold off. So, but I just keep these two as my favorites. Uh, in the in Malaysia, the the Chinese uh, used to call this uh, sangyi uh, or haruan. So, but there's a uh, different species. This one is the the better species uh, with color. Uh, the price is also higher, so much higher than the 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 general that you can buy in the market for consumptions, which uh, is without color. It's normally uh, darker brown or black or something like that. They, normally, the Chinese like to use it uh, uh, to cook uh, in together with the porridge. You know? And they believe uh, it has a very good uh, healing power. If you have surgery or something like that, uh, it has a very good uh, healing uh, on your wounds. Okay. So now uh, I'm going to fit uh, the bigger uh, chana first, the top chana with one of these um, uh, frog. Okay. So. Let's see how was it. Okay, I will show it to you first. Uh, you, you can see how aggressive it. Uh, in fact, I I'm uh, worried that they splash the water all over. So, yeah, you can see how maybe it's uh, hungry. But I feed them feed them every day once, uh, so they are still always uh, very hungry. Okay. They're just chasing the, the frog. You can see? Okay, I better throw it in. Oops! 
Oh, I, I, I think you almost cannot get it on camera because immediately the frog uh, dropped into the water. Uh, it has been swallowed whole by the by the my fish. Okay, it's uh, the the frog is kind of big, so it takes some time for the fish to swallow it. Uh, okay, I think um, that's it for today. There's no more other meals. Uh, this meal should last the fish at least 24 hours. Okay, um, let's see the fish again. So it's already fit. Uh, normally, uh, after it fits, it will go down and take a rest. Uh, maybe to allow the the digestions to, to take place and so on. So my so I'm gonna come and cover it up. This fish is okay. It doesn't jump always, but the bottom part, the bottom fish here, the red barito, the China red barito, uh, is a bit naughty. I mean, I, if you can see here, I I put a tape here because because um, this guy here, this guy here, as you can see, is how how aggressive it is. This guy here frequently jump. Uh, in fact, uh, in uh, in one location. This fish actually jumped out and was found a few hours later by my niece. Luckily, she found it because I'm I'm not at home. Okay, so I'm going to open it and today is a special day. I'm going to feed him also with uh, one of the frog. I'll choose one of the bigger frog. Okay, where is it? Oh my god, it was so slippery. Uh, okay. Okay, yeah. So here comes your food. Okay. Ah, okay. here you can see. Oh my God, it was so aggressive. Oh. Can you see it? Yeah. Okay. I'm not sure if I throw it in, it still have time because it will grab it as soon as it drop into the water. As you can see, um, practically the frog has no time to just swim around and it has been swallowed whole uh, by the red burrito it's gone okay okay, okay. so basically this uh, kind of a pet fish you don't need to feed them every day but I chose to feed them every day uh, some some keepers say you can keep them uh, you can feed them like three days or, or uh, once a week or something like that uh, but uh, I, I, I like to see them eat and I, I feed them almost every day once I feed them worms uh, uh, most of the day is worms uh, occasionally it's frog like uh, what you see just now and also uh, baby koi fish and sometimes other kind of uh, baby fish like uh, the tilapia fish um, yeah but I said uh, I have never fed them with uh, because some people say uh, feed them with you know, baby catfish but uh, I have never tried that before okay so let's take a look again on my fish now I believe she's a happy fish uh, because she's already eaten she's full I'm not sure whether she still want to eat but of course I believe if I throw in another frog she will also swallow it but I'm not going to do that okay uh, you see, my burrito is still one. It's still aggressive. Well, as you can see, the the, the tummy already bulge. The, the tummy is already bulge. So that's that's it for today. Uh, the next meal will be next uh, twenty four hours. So this too is my favorite fish, um, which I keep from very small, about six inch. Uh, I bought it um, around uh, Ringgit Malaysia 100 that time. I'm not sure how much it worth now, but because I have no plan to sell it or, or something like that. Okay, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, that's it for today, and thank you very much. Take care. Bye bye.